Hello everyone, welcome to Tutorials Point. In this video, we are going to introduce ourselves to the next step of Myasis which is Myasis 2. Initially, we have talked about Myasis 1. Now, Myasis 2 is, Myasis 1 is followed by Myasis 2. So, let us see what happens in Myasis 2. Myasis 2 is similar to that of mitosis that we have initially discussed, but Myasis 2 is quite shorter than that of mitosis. The number of chromosomes is maintained over here. This is uh, similar to the activities performed in case of mitosis. But in Myasis 1, we have seen the number of chromosomes got reduced. But here, the number of chromosomes is maintained. This is called homotypic or equational division. Why equational division? Because the chromosome numbers are maintained and it is not getting reduced. So, the uh, same cells or the parental cell uh, will have the same number of chromosomes as the daughter cells. So, this is known as equational divisions. The presence of interkinesis which involves the synthesis of RNA and proteins. Now, the end of myosis 1 and in between myosis 2. So, in this phase there may be a short phase of pause between in these cells. So, this may or may not be present. It is not mandatory. So, this is the phase where the cells uh, maintain a short pause where some of the proteins and RNAs may be synthesized. This phase is known as the phase of interkinesis. Now, myosis 2 is not absolutely mitosis because it always occurs in case of haploid cells not preceded by DNA replication. In case of mitosis, we know that is preceded by DNA replication, but in myosis 2, this is not preceded by the process of DNA replication. The two chromatids are often dissimilar. Why? Because in myosis, we have seen in myosis 1, because of the process of crossing over, that chromosomes, they have changed their exchange, their genes to some extent. So, they will never be absolutely similar to each other. So, the daughter cells which are formed are quite different from each other because of the process of recombination with the help of recombinase enzyme. So, in this video, we have introduced ourselves to the process of myosis 2. I hope you have understood this video. Thank you.